What's up, YouTube? Rusty Small, RC5Fitness.com. Going to make another cooking video. What's up? We're going to make two meals tonight. We're going to make sausage, turkey sausage, that is, egg whites, and I'm going to make the wife some eggs as well because she don't do the egg whites, and she don't need them, I do. And then we're going to be... Don't interrupt the video. I don't need your yakety yak. You don't eat egg whites. You eat the whole egg. She's lying. But anyway, look at that face. Look at that face. She does do the egg white light. I'm just kidding. Look at our cool tree. Look at our cool tree. Hey, hit the button. Hit the button. Hit the button. Where our house is not completely I It don't matter. I'm looking at the tree, man. Look, just do the tree. Do the tree. Elegant. Homie. Elegant and homie. She did a good job on that tree. Check out this. Mistletoe. Gonna give me some sugar later. Oh, anyway. Chester. You can show yeah, oh, you guys gotta see Chester. Hold on a minute. And Chester. Chester. Sir Hawthorne, the bloodhound. We got him at, uh, what was the name of that place? Bombay yeah. Company. Bombay Company, which is no longer in business. And, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. And the rest of the decorations are, like, right there. So, anyway, <laughs> there'll be tons of, of uh, Christmas cheer all over the house. But, anyway, let me show you what we're working with right now. So, we've got lean steak tips here, all right? It's basically just chopped up lean steak and boneless, of course. And then we've got some stir-fry veggies that we're going to be preparing. And then we've got the good old Jimmy Dean's turkey sausage links. And the macros on this is 130 calories for three links. You get 8 grams of total fat, uh, zero trans fat, only 2.5 grams of saturated fat. And we've got only 2 grams of carbs. And there's uh, one less than 1 gram of sugar in this, which I'm sure that's flavor. And you get 13 grams of protein. 13 grams of protein for three sausage links. That's insane. Anyway, that is pretty good. That's pretty good. Um, and I got to get the egg whites. Uh, they're back there somewhere. I'll get them in just a few minutes when I get everything prepared. When I start preparing everything, I'll uh, pop back on the video and uh, we'll get this cooking rolling. Let me get everything prepared and ready to go in the pan and I'll be right back. Okay, guys, we've went ahead and done the no, the off-brand or food line or whatever cooking spray. We've already prepared these two. I've got the heat on this guy first. I'm not going to do the stir-fried vegetables with the, the sausage and the eggs going on. I don't like to cross-contaminate my cooking area. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and do this first. And then once I get the sausage done, I'll go ahead and put the eggs in. And then I'll do the stir-fried vegetables first. And then I'll do the beef. So I want to make sure I always do my vegetables first, and then I throw my beef. I take those out, and I throw my beef in there, and then I mix them together. So anyway, give me just a couple minutes, and we'll get this rolling. Here we go. Okay, guys, here's the sausage. We already got the turkey sausage in the pan, and it's sizzling. What's up? Yeah, I'm talking about. And this is already pre-cooked turkey sausage, so you don't really have to cook it a lot. But I like mine crispy, so I like to do it. You could actually technically put this in the microwave for about a minute or so, even from from the refrigerator or freezer. It only take a minute or two. You can just defrost it for a minute if it's in the freezer, and then put it in there and, and go ahead and cook it for about a minute. And you'd be good to go, probably no more than two minutes, because you would ruin it. And uh, we got the vegetables already out. I gotta wash those. Here's a tip, always wash your vegetables because you don't want poopy hands on your vegetables. Okay, people don't wash their hands like they used to anymore. Matter of fact, when I was a kid um, uh, and they used to have the Saturday morning cartoons, they would have, you know, the little songs, wash your hands, wash your hands, and all this other stuff. And you know, they don't, you remember that too? And uh, do what? Oh yeah, our neighbor almost died. It wasn't bag salad, it was bagged mushrooms, prepared mushrooms. He would just eat mushrooms from the store every day. They would be pre-washed. And he was eating them. He came down with some type of uh, fungal infection in his intestines that was like from a third world country. And he was getting those... Wash those bag uh, yeah, washed bag salad too. That uh, The actual CDC actually contacted him uh, because his doctor sent the uh, his lab results, his blood work, off to a lab. And they actually flagged for some parasite from... A third world country, and they were calling him and asking if he'd been out of the country lately, and all this stuff. And it's actually the mushrooms 
uh, whatever this fungal infection came from, people not washing their hands. So wash your vegetables, wash your fruits, wash your bag salad, wash it all. Wash it! Rub it up, dub! Scrub it up! Scrub it up, people. All right, I'll be right back in just a minute, and we'll uh, keep cooking here, and I'll just keep popping in, because I don't want to video the whole thing, because then it's going to be like a 20 minute long video. So give me a couple minutes. Nobody wants to hear you ramble. And nobody wants to hear me ramble, that's right. Thanks, hon. Okay, guys, the sausage is out of the pan, and I got to re uh, heat it, and I got to make sure we put some cooking spray in there, getting ready to throw the eggs in there. So uh, the wife wants to try some sausage. So her wait just a minute because it's hot. It's hot! It's hot! How's that sausage, baby? I, 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 like, I see you in that sausage is good. <laughs> is it good? It is. Take a bite. You know what makes it even better? Do a little better? taste of what? That I cooked it and you didn't you have to? I cooked it and I didn't have to. Okay. <laughs> is it good? Mmm, don't that look delicious? Mmm, yeah. taste test time! Taste test, baby! Turkey sausage is where it's at! It's good for your heart. Good for your body. Tell them what? Barrett's possum. Barrett's possum. Wait, no, wait, we can't tell that. Time. We can't tell the possum story. Hold on a minute. We got to go off camera. Hey, I can't tell you the possum story right now, but I will. We'll do a video. We tried the video. With, Barrett. Well, we tried to video uh, my daughter's boyfriend Barrett uh, about his possum story. He's a hunter, and um, he goes out. Bam, bam. Yeah, that's not how it started. No. We'll just tell one part. No. It's you a can teaser. All, you can all, Okay, here's a teaser. Ready? Okay. okay. Here. here we go. Teaser. So time. Teaser daughter, time. My daughter says. Barrett, tell him how you rolled down the hill screaming like a girl. And he walks into the kitchen real casual. This was on Thanksgiving Day. He leans up, he gets the counter all cool, and he goes, Well, there was a possum in the field. That's all I'm going to That's tell all you can tell. you got to stop right there. <laughs> there was a possum in the field, and that's what you get. Possum in the field. So we're going to get Barrett. Is he coming home this weekend? He comes home. If weekend. he comes home this weekend from college and he comes over, we will get him to tell the story on camera. I promise you, I will make him do it. If he don't, I'll just choke him out. I'm just kidding. I'll choke him out. No, we, right, love right. no, we love Barry. No, let me get the, oh, my pan's on fire. Let me uh, get this thing rolling here. Pan's on fire. Is it really right. on? No, no, it's on fire. I'm just joking. Um, it it's not. Good. It's just, there's no grease in there. It's just burn up all the grease. All right, guys, let me crack a few eggs. We're out of egg whites, so I'm going to show you a really easy trick to do the egg whites without doing the egg whites. So. Without having an egg white. How do you spin. zoom? I forgot. You don't want to zoom. I just wondered. Oh, don't zoom. All right. So you see, you get one of these handy things. Please see the holes in it. See the holes? Can you see that? They're not stupid. They. I don't know. Can you see it? I can see it. They're not okay. stupid. I didn't say they were stupid. I want to make sure the camera can see it. Yeah, it's got teeth and it's got holes. Awesome. It's got teeth and holes. So you take one of these. You crack your egg, and you drop it. Come over here. You drop it in there. Because we're out of egg whites. Because we're out of egg whites. And you just jiggle it around. And you can actually pour out the egg. And Your hand's blocking the shot. See that big goob? There you go. And then, now you've got the egg yolk here. And you just... Uh, dump don't right dump down. that down my sink. Oh, it's going to be all right. I wash it down the sink. It provides good bacteria for the... Uh, tell them bye-bye now. I'm going to change. No. Oh. So that's how you do your egg whites. You just crack it in here, get a good shot of that, bloop, and then it just goes through the holes. And if it won't go through the holes, and you get a really thick yolk egg, you just hold the yolk in there with the egg and jiggle it till it pops right up. Look at that! Uh, 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 it's hanging on for dear life. Come on, get off there. It's hurting my there we go. All right, and you dump that right down the sink. Or you can throw it in the trash. Either way you want to do it. She would prefer that I throw it in the trash, but anyway. All right, let me prepare these, and we'll be right back with you. Got the flat egg thing going on here. I'm not going to scramble these because she wants a flat egg to put on some whole wheat bread to go along with the turkey sausage. I don't know why she wants that, but I'm not doing any bread today. So, all right, let me go ahead and get some cooking spray here. Go ahead and spray this guy down. Get ready for the vegetables. I'm going to come over here. I throw a little water in the old vegetables here. Let those soak for just a minute. Let those soak. Mmm, that's cooking up fast. That means we always want to put a little pepper on there because she likes it. She likes the way I pepper. All right, let's see here. All right, let's get a little flippy view. See if I can flip with one hand while holding the camera. And video. Oh, look at that skill. 
Look at that skill, ladies and gentlemen. How do you like our new stove? Isn't that cool? It's double oven. Let me take this off. Double ovens, man. And that's my little trash bag. I use the to put the eggs and stuff in. That way they don't stink up your trash. You can tie it up. We got a brand new Whirlpool refrigerator with the freezer in the bottom. Look at our cabinets. Aren't they cool? My wife designed this whole layout right here. We have to get this right here. It's not painted because we got it from Lowe's. And uh, it uh, has a crack in the door, so they're going to have to send us a new door. But look at our new cabinets. Isn't it really cool? They're a cool uh, ceiling fan. I'm loving it. I'm digging the new appliance. New dishwasher, all new appliances. That's what I'm talking about. New flooring. New flooring's coming right after the first of the year. We've got to get rid of this ugly carpet. And uh, I can't wait for that to happen. Yes! So, new kitchen. That's what we've been doing with our time, guys. That's why we have not been on YouTube. We've been planning a wedding. Our daughter got married about three weeks ago. And we had to renovate this kitchen at the same time, which was kind of crazy of me to um, plan all that and do all that at one time. But I had big aspirations and goals. So, anyway, let me uh, finish cooking these eggs and stuff, and I'll be right back to you. Okay, so here we got <clears throat> the two egg whites and two whole eggs. That's about uh, 35 grams of protein right there, between 25 and 35. Now, I've got me some veggies over here on the stir-fry pan. I got a little bit of pink Himalayan salt right here. I'm just going to throw in a little bit of that because it has lower sodium than regular salt and lower than regular sea salt. So, we're going to let that marinate. I put a little black pepper in there and my special ingredient a little lowry's uh that is lowry's yeah lowry's garlic powder seasoning i don't use the garlic salt because the garlic salt of course has salt in it and as we get older you know we don't need as much salt in our diet as young people can do it a little bit better than we can they can process all that sodium out of their system all right so we're going to let this go ahead and heat up and I'll just kind of move this stuff around here a little bit. Pan ain't got quite hot enough yet. So we'll let that sit and marinate for a couple minutes. Turn the heat up a little bit on that bad boy. Maybe get that thing cooking. So we'll be right back in just a couple minutes. And then we're going to get the Feast of Resistance, the steak, going. All right, we'll be back. And two and two, as Chuck Wooler used to say on Love Connection. Two and two. Guys, we got the meat in the pan. We got it browning. It's gonna go fast because these pieces are cut really small. So again, we got a little bit of Lowry's garlic powder seasoning, not garlic salt, because it's not good for you. Got a little bit of pepper action in there. Give it a little extra flavor. We're gonna let this continue to marinate. The vegetables are already done, so all we're waiting on is the beef here. We can start packaging these in our uh, containers for work so hold on we'll be right back we'll be right back after these messages two and two okay guys let's take take a look at our our steak tips uh, on my fitness pal says steak tips 170 calories zero carbs eight grams of fat 24 grams of protein for only four ounces can you see that it might be Auto focus is keeping it so four ounces of steak tips is 170 calories, 24 grams of protein, and eight grams of fat, zero carbs, which is awesome. And this right here, high fiber macros, right there, and it's going to be delicious. So let's get the scale out and let's weigh this up. Okay, we got our canisters, we got our scale all zeroed out, we got our container here. I said canister, it's container. All right, we got to put four ounces of this beef in here. So here we go. Not even an ounce. There's one and a half. You think four ounces of meat is a lot, but it's actually really not. You can see how much I'm getting on the... All right, that's 2.7. Hmm. All right, let's see. This is supposed to be a pound of ground beef, so. Ooh, almost 3.9. There we go. We are close. Bam! Four on the money, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Let's put a little bit of this on this side. Make it look even. Kind of 
anal like that. All right. There we go. We got our four ounces there. So now we're going to zero that guy out. Zero it out. All right. And we're going to go for our veggies. So here we go. There's one ounce. Let's get some tomatoes in there. Come on, tomatoes. I have to pick those up where I am. Two, almost two ounces. Oh, two and a half. I'm going to have to use my hands. Sorry, guys. It is messy fingers time. 3.4. Where's all my veggies gone? 4.2, 4.1. We'll take it. Boom. All right. That's our meal for tomorrow. That's lunch tomorrow. Done. 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 I have enough there for another meal. Okay, guys, I'm totally done with my meal and done with my meal prep for the next day. So check it out. Here's what we got. There's my meal today. I got my steak tips. I got a couple of egg whites in there. Got some veggies on top. Basically, very low carb, high protein, low fat meal. I've got eggs and turkey sausage for another meal tomorrow. And I have more steak and veggies down there for lunch tomorrow. So that's breakfast and lunch tomorrow, and I'll have a protein shake after I work out at lunch as well. So, and then I'll come home and eat a meal. So you guys have a great day from rc5fitness.com. I hope you liked our video. Click like, click subscribe, hit the thumbs up button, not the thumbs down button down there. Come see us on Instagram. Uh, come see us on Facebook, Snapchat, add us everywhere. We're going to blow up large for you. You guys have a great day from rc5fitness.com. Peace out.